Hello there, I am Deuce Coffee. And I'm Daiz. And just when you thought 2020 could not get any scarier, this is our annual Halloween special. That's right, Daiz. I'm not sure what's scarier, 2020 or my video game jump scare review. Check it out. What's up guys, my name is Maurice Coffee, and I'm back with more horror. This time I'm bringing to you the top 5 video game jump scare reactions. Enjoy. Coming in at number 5, we have YouTuber KSI and his brother Comedy Shorts Gamer. If you don't know who he is, here's a picture of him coming up right now. I actually don't know what game they're playing, but um, this is just a funny reaction just because it's them. And if you watch YouTube and keep up with it, you know who these guys are. So watch the video and enjoy. Alright, I was actually mistaken. This is the YouTuber KSI and his brother reacting. So, uh, yeah, that's just a mistake on my fault. Yeah, what's funny to me about this video is just that um, the way that his brother threw his glasses and um, how KSI just laid out on the bed like he got knocked out or something. Alright, now we'll be moving on. Gotcha, I did not. Nah, I'm just kidding. Coming in at number four, we have this YouTuber. I actually don't know his name, but he's actually playing Five Nights at Freddy's, and this is one of my favorite scary games to play, especially as a kid. So uh, check this out. Oh, it it only just one at a time. Oh! Am I dead? Oh! Wait, wait, wait. This is right here, this out room, so let me see this one, maybe. Oh no. Oh! What? As you can see, um, the way this guy screams is the reason why he's number four. He, um, was absolutely terrified as you can see absolutely terrified and uh, he screamed really loud which is the reason why I made him number four so yeah all right coming in at number three we have a uh, typical gamer girlfriend she plays a lot of horror games on YouTube channel it was actually pretty cool I actually subscribed to her um, she's playing this game called Emily wants to play and if you ever play Mario Kart you know the ghosts when you turn around they follow you and you're not looking at them well the little girl was doing just this and she keeps turning off lights every time she leaves the room and just it's just scary you you have to watch it to see so yeah she moves when I'm not looking at her though but it's scary <laughs> stop following me please go back to wherever you came from I don't like you goodbye miss we're going back in this room and we're leaving you because you're terrifying Gosh. Oh. Uh. oh, why are all the lights off now? Oh gosh, I don't like this. I don't like this at all. I don't like this one bit. Oh, she's gone. Where'd she go? Where'd she go? Uh. We need a flashlight. Is there a flashlight in this game? Why is it so dark? Can you turn the lights on? Oh, okay. All right, that's better. That's better. All right. She ain't messing with us anymore. We showed her. Right, guys? Oh, nope. Keeping the lights on. We are so keeping the lights on. Oh. Who turned those lights off? Um. I don't appreciate them turning the lights off. Why is it dark everywhere? <laughs> Yep, I knew it was over for her when she turned around and opened that door. I'm thinking the jump scare was going to happen in that door, but she turned back around and Emily hopped right back out and got her. You never supposed to turn around in movies, nothing, when it's dark especially, and that's why I knew it was over. Coming in at number two, we have YouTuber Big Star. I don't know the numbers by his name, but if you watch YouTube, you should also know this guy. He's very popular on YouTube. Okay, so this game is a new game I just came upon. It's not new to the world, but it's new to me because I just discovered it. But I love this game, and his reaction is very genuine. That's why he came at number two. Um, Josh? Um. <laughs> Ah! 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 Oh 
Holy s**t! Ah! Oh my god! You actually scared the shit out of me! I was looking at Simon on the other side, Josh. I, I nearly cried. Nah, my heart. I tried to let you guys know about that jump scare. It was real. I ain't gonna lie, it's one of the scariest games. Just because you can play with your friends and they can pop up any time on you. And your friend is actually the killer and it's not like a, a computer to say. So it doesn't have a time limit on the jump. But now we're gonna move on. Coming in at number one, we got everybody's favorite YouTuber, PewDiePie. Nah, but uh, this reaction, it wasn't really scary. It's just funny because he literally talks about him over the years getting jump scared. So he knew it was coming and still got scared. So I literally watched every single video that he put up and uh, you'll just see. I'm playing as far as I possibly could from the screen because I know, I know by now the games. They're gonna jump in my face. All right. I know the games by now. I know how it works. Oh, oh. I played so many horror games. I know how they work now. They're gonna jump scare me right in the face. Five Nights at Freddy's. Ah! I've seen that all before. What the was that, Sam? All right, guys. Those are my top five video game jump scare reviews. For this month's Halloween special, I hope you guys liked uh, liked the video. Let me know how it is. Let me know how, anything I can work on. Just, I just want to be the best me I can be. Thank you, and have a good Halloween. Ha <laughs> ha. Wow, that was pretty scary, dudes, but I think our video was pretty cool, too. We went around and asked a few staff members about our Halloween characters. Hello, welcome to our Halloween special. Today, we are guessing Halloween characters with teachers. Hello, today we are with Mr. Irish. Hello. <laughs> Michael Myers? Yeah. Is it actually right? Okay. Uh, I couldn't even tell you, man. Do I just guess it? Give me a hint. Doesn't help me. You really just have to skip. Jason. Dang. That one's uh, Scream. Okay. Jack the Ripper or something. Edward. Edward. No, that, that's uh, that's Edward Scissorhands, right? No. Dang. What? I don't know. <laughs> so that's what I have no idea. Jack. Is it Jack? Yes. Sir. Okay. Oh, that's a dude. Uh, well, I don't know, but I, I've seen that movie though. Leatherface, okay. He's got bees on it. Is that bees on his head? I don't know. Bee man? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> uh, that's that dude from Saw, right? I don't know. Is it? What's it say on there? I don't know. I don't know his name. Billy the Puppet, okay. <laughs> What's he got? Nails on his head? I've never seen it, man. I don't watch movies, I told you. I don't know. Hellraiser? Okay. Alright. <laughs> Probably not even that, man. I, what it tells me is I need to watch more movies. But, I don't know. Video games are my thing, so. <laughs> Boy, if you don't- Here guessing Halloween characters with Miss Timka. Hello. Oh, you want me to hold this thing? Okay. That's Jason. No, no, sorry, that's not Jason. That's Michael Myers. <laughs> right, next one. That's Jason. Scream. Freddy Krueger. Jack Skellington. Leatherface. Oh. Is that the candy man? <laughs> wow, seven for seven. <laughs> That's Pinhead. No. Yes, it is. No. Yes, it is. No. <laughs> yes, it is. That's not his name. Okay, go ahead. What's his name? Thank you for participating. No problem. This was fun. <laughs> no! The character is not called Hellraiser. No, the character is called Pinhead. The character is Pinhead. I told you 
That's so. like saying Dorothy is called the Wizard of Oz. Yes! It's wow. the movie Look, name. And it specifically says, read this sentence out loud for me. Read it. Pinhead. Pinhead is a fictional character in the main antagonist of the Hellraiser So franchise. say it. I was wrong. Say it. Repeat after me. <laughs> I was wrong. You were right. You were right. And you're my you favorite are teacher. smart. You are smart. I am not intelligent. I am not intelligent. <laughs> you are attractive. <laughs> you are attractive. I am not so good looking. Okay. Not so good looking. <laughs> good job, Daiz. Shout out to Miss Timco. She's like the queen of Halloween. You should know better than to question her. Next up, check out Natalie and Elvio's band chronicles. I think they did a ghost hunt. and the lights would like flicker. It was so weird. And then we started taking pictures with my pol like Polaroid camera and we started getting like film back. And it was like all fuzzy, like it wouldn't, like it was black, it was pitch black. Oh. And then whenever we were sitting right there, we felt like wind, it was so weird. It was so and during, whenever we were in here for sectionals, yeah. we saw a man sitting there. It was like, if there's someone in here, give us a sign. Stop. Fish. So funny, oh, yeah, the monsters. <laughs> <laughs> Liv's brother, he used to do the set stuff, uh -huh. and one time he was back there, and he had a, I think it's like a brown out. Did you hear that? Mm -hmm. There wasn't anything. No, I swear. He used to do the set stuff, uh -huh. and one time he was back there, and he had a, and he had a, and he had a. And he had a no, I swear. No, for real. Like, I swear this place is haunted. Yeah. Swear to God. If there's anyone here, please give us a sign. And also, I think it's someone. I think it's someone old because whenever, because whenever we felt the wind back there, um, Maurice was doing his like Vietnam like speech. Hello? 
Don't be shy, come in the room. No, I'm looking out for you. Yeah, the printer's not mine. What? What? Can you see that light there? What light? The light under the exit, like, like ladder oh, to the, the exit. Oh, that's the, that's a garage light. Yeah, but it, like, went dim for a sec. <clears throat> like, something went past it, but I don't know. I don't know if it just does that. Hey, come on, come on, come on. No, it's okay, come on, let's go. Like in the back. Go, go, honey. Like in the back. No. It was. It was like the stuff. Let's see. Hello. Is anyone in here? If there's anyone in here, please give us a sign. <laughs> I'm scared. I don't even get out of this room. <laughs> Why does my shadow look like that? <laughs> Wait, you got here? It was a two-book. It's almost those, like, stay in places where all the electricity. But, like, power and stuff. Not necessarily. Okay, good. They just go wherever they're attached to. Is there anyone here? <clears throat> Harvey was built on, like, an Indian burial ground. Of course like, it was. No, Everything like, was. I mean, like, I think there, no, it was a cemetery. The old Harvey that, um, oh, yeah, yeah. by where, like, used to live. <clears throat> It was like built on a cemetery, and I don't know if like those people followed here because like it's part of that. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> For Jones. I like the fit. Because I hope everybody has a beautiful day. I agree. I hope that you guys have a day full of love and joy and peace and happiness. Whoa, that ghost hunt was pretty scary, but not as scary as how good our boy soccer team is. That's right, Deuce. The boys' soccer team is now 13, 1, and 1, and is now competing for the postseason. Let's check out some of the highlights Eduardo made. Hello, my name is Eduardo. I'm behind the boys' soccer team edits, the highlights, actually. The boys currently have 12 wins, 1 tie, and 1 loss. This Saturday, we will be having a soccer game against Open Door Christian in the morning, around 11, I believe. And on Wednesday, we will be having our first round of playoffs against Euclid. If you guys would like to come out and see, go ask Walling. He'll probably be selling pre-sale tickets. Um, yeah, in the next videos you'll be seeing special edition for Halloween, hopefully. And as always, go Raiders.
Great job, boys. In other sports news, the volleyball team got really dressed up in the Halloween spirits and had a practice for Halloween. Let's check out what Chester did. We're done? Okay. Oh wait, we got our Thanksgiving special coming up next month. Stay tuned. I can't put on my mask. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, I'm out. I'll see you when it's time to cook the turkeys. <laughs>